Hello to everyone. Welcome, dear friends and colleagues, especially from and in Ukraine, to our lecture series, Ukrainian Research Online. I'm very happy to finally announce the launch of a lecture series, which is part of the fundraising campaign for endangered scholars that the Ukraine Initiative at the University of Erfurt, the University Society of Erfurt, and the research initiative Political Epistemologies of Central and Eastern Europe, PC, have put together. The aim of our series is to provide visibility for our Ukrainian colleagues and their work. The broader field of the lectures are the humanities and the social sciences, and the talks vary from presentations of ongoing research to analysis of the current political and cultural situation in the Ukraine and on the war of aggression and its historical background and possible consequences. With this, we want to provide a platform for Ukrainian research and at the same time initiate scholarly exchange. We would like to enable the participants to have a continuing discussion in which their topics and thesis can be further developed. And of course, in order to provide at least a little bit of help to those of our speakers that are still in Ukraine, we can offer a small remuneration for their talks. Thus, I'd like to encourage all of our viewers to donate so that we can help as many colleagues as possible. You can do this by transferring money to the account of the University Society Erfurt, and you can find all the relevant information in the text to this channel or at our PC website, which we will insert in the video and in the description below. Thank you very much for your interest. Thank you very much for your help. And most of all, thank you very much to our colleagues from Ukraine that have given the following talks even under the worst possible circumstances. Шановні українські колеги, нашою ініціативою ми хочемо підтримати вас під час цієї страшної війни. І ми щиро сподіваємося, що незабаром ми зрошимо сутриця там не наше місце на міжнародних конференціях.